Hello guys, Mark is here again, and I guess I did two recording tests. I guess. I don't know, I was looking through my stuff and hey, found this, and I might as well post it on YouTube. So, this is another match I got into. Yeah, this is a short match actually. Torpo right at the bat, I guess that's okay weapon to handle. But this guy's here, what is he doing? I have no idea, must be some kind of guy up there. Got a red kill sign. My torque though. Oh, look at this guy. Oh, I'm sorry. I should be stopped. Right behind me. Run away. Run away. Incoming frag! I'm waiting. Wait, there he is. There he is. Oh. I was probably gonna do some cool things. Boom, bitch! <laughs> Do that guy, but he liked my torque bow. I kind of liked it too. It wasn't anything really special, I guess, but I, I liked it. Nevertheless. What's the deal, you ain't talking anymore? Oh, oh, yeah, whatever. I'll leave the torque bow. And to get a sniper, I'll just watch. Oh, okay. yeah. I just don't feel like staying in that game. So, let's find another game. And look at all those gridlocks. Imagine that. Seriously, I, there are other good maps too. Gridlock is good, but still, you, every match. Anyway, here's. Yeah, that guy's glitching. Here's Field Depot. Used to be my favorite map. At least when I first started. It's a full game. I have no idea what the fuck people are doing. One guy's shooting at a sniper rifle. Another guy's glitching. Eh, whatever. Little do I know. Hey, look at that. Holy crap. Oh, that's fancy. I guess that works. I wasn't even ready for that, but. That was another guy. I have my pistol. Uh, that was one of those cool glitches where he kind of gets down, but he still. That was a nice headshot, and I got kicked. Yeah, I'm pretty sure that may have been something wrong along. I'm yeah, might have been something along the lines of an all sniper match or something like that, and. I kind of went in there, chainsawed someone, pistoled someone. Yeah, I don't think they liked it that much. Eh. I don't like any of those matches. The all snipers, you know, don't do anything else. Uh, all glitching matches and all that crap. Yeah, I don't like any of those kind of things. Friendly fire too, that that stuff is good, I like it, but it just gets out of control sometimes. And I got active. And hey, I'm up oh, I'm not alive. Never mind. And those are the other things. Active downs, uh you no, know, two piece. Two piece can be kind of fun though, because people don't use it as often and you know. It can be defended against now. At least in Gears 1. In Gears 2, it still sucks. Crab walking. That's also kind of horrible. And I have no idea why I got kicked in that game. That seems to happen a lot, actually. I wonder why that is. Because I'm not particularly bad. and At least that match, I didn't really ruin anything. <laughs> so now I'm trying to figure out which match I didn't already go into before. Yeah, these are some quick rounds. But of course, we're back to Ridlock again. Nice. <sighs> How would you stand still like that? You know, pe some people just aren't good. And, and it's their fault too, so, you know. That yeah, but walk slowly so they don't uh, necessarily hear you right away. No one over here. 
sniper. No. Aww. Yeah, so right now I'm just trying to take the home thing because I know nobody can snipe me because I'm too good to that. Times I used to. <laughs> I got you. I got you. And I do the chainsaw glitch. That's a pretty legitimate glitch. I'm okay with that. That, that was that was an admittedly nice headshot there. I'll, I'll give him that. I should actually record some new Gears footage, just for fun. Maybe some multiplayer or whatever. I don't know, would you guys enjoy that? I don't know, leave a comment. That guy had it coming to him all the way. The runaway chainsaw glitch is okay, like, uh, that's what I do. But there's another glitch where it's a walk through chainsaw glitch. Basically what that is, is as long as you're not, uh, ready running or rowing around or anything. You uh, basically just touch them and they explode as if they're being chainsaw. That's <coughs> because if you're a group of four guys, you uh, do the glitch, they all die instantly. That's that's a little unfair. No, I don't even know how to do half these glitches anymore. I'm an old school glitch player. It's pretty amazing though. People actually still uh, play Gears One online. Hey, look, guys, a sniper. Yeah, I deserve that. I was just trying to chainsaw a bit more. <laughs> yeah, but a lot of what you want is stuff kind of unexpected. You know, people always go like that Marcus guy. He's going right towards the uh, edge of the staircase. People are expecting that. They know how to see you, and there are easy ways to kill you that way. You know, if you stand behind maybe the second pillar. Or Oh, I, <laughs> that was a two-piece failure. See, I, I'm, not, I'm not good at doing... Uh, yeah, he's letting me bleed out, so I won't give him the kill. But uh, what I was doing there is... You run like you're going into the uh, back little alley there. and Then you dive back out, you run towards there. And you kind of zigzag in the front there. And they're always expecting you to go to behind. They're not used to that, so... If they have a sniper, it's kind of hard to uh, kill the person as they're running up. I don't know, just do things unexpected with their uh, gears and it should be fine. Damn it. That's, that's what good gears players do. I actually was in an uh, MLG clan at some point, but uh, I'm in the zone, baby. Uh, they were decent snipers. I was probably one of the better ones, I guess, but um, the leader was kind of a loser, but and this is because I just won the match, and the weapon shows up, but it's not there. I don't know how I was doing this, because this never works. I can't shoot through the road. More because really you can use a lancer legitimately and uh, win. You know? It's not all shotgun. It's all you know shotgun makes very nice. You know how to use it. Um, you can't win. But if you know how to use a lancer too, you can use that very well. And that was just leggy as hell. I think that's like the first phrase or something. Whatever. Yeah. My guy. I'm looking for enemies, but a lot of times they're kind of just hard to find. <laughs> because I'm a much better announcer than he is a sniper. Yeah. That's how it goes. <laughs> Look at a boom shot. It was actually kind of rare to find in uh, 
Matthews, regular player Matthews, I should say. Oh, they, that's uh, he's down. That's not bad. But, uh, I don't know, it's not necessarily a bad thing, I guess, but people overuse it. They just give it a bad name. So, you know, here, protecting the annex, this is a really, really effective way to protect it if you have, like, a lancer out or kind of a longer range weapon like this, because you can all see him coming. The only bad thing about this is that snipers coming up the stairs can get you, or, you know, stuff like that. In those cases, or if you want to use a shotgun, just go straight up there and be ready to shoot them as they're coming through the little corridor. There's a guy, there's a guy, and that, that was just a mess. And I don't know how he got out of that, I should have been able to melee him twice. Double melee and all that, you know.